going to be showing you today how to um, project from your computer screen. Um, starting from the beginning, you come in. This wall switch over here is for uh, the projector screen, so flip that down. Handy dandy remote, red button, point it at the projector. Press the red button, give it a second to come on. While that is coming on, you should see um, blue on the screen here. It says Panasonic, just letting you know it's coming on. The cords and cables will be in these two little cubby boxes over here. There are two different um, types of cables. So I'm using a Mac, so I need to use this cable. If I were using a PC, I would use this or an HDMI cable, which is right here. And then you would plug the HDMI into your HDMI port or this fat cable into your VGA port. This specifically for newer Macs goes into your Thunderbolt ports. Now, if you're doing audio, this is your auxiliary cable. Um, sometimes your aux cable is going to be hooked up to your VGA. Even if you're running a Mac and you want to use audio, you still need this cord plugged in to your um, headphones jack or microphone jack on your computer. So what I'm doing here is on my computer up at the top right there is um, a way to change the display when I'm plugged into the Thunderbolt port. I'm going to um, turn on dis or turn off display mirroring. Up at the top, there are the different input options. Just use the arrow pads on the remote to switch over to what you are um, going to be connecting with. All right, so if you're using the HDMI cable, you will select DVI at the top. If you are not using HDMI or using the VGA cable, you will want to select the first um, computer tab at the top left. Sometimes um, when you have everything plugged up and everything running, it, you won't be able to see it. It won't come up because it's muted. Just press the AV mute button. Point the remote up at the projector and press AV mute and it should unmute whatever is on your screen. Whenever you um, whenever you get everything set up, you want to make sure that you go ahead and turn off the light switch that's next to the uh, projector screen switch so that it makes it easier to see what you have up here on the screen. Whenever you guys are done using the projector and screen, make sure that you turn off the projector. Uh, it's going to ask you to hit the power button twice, turn off the projector. Make sure that you uh, put this screen back up. Unplug all the cables that you use, and just put them back in the uh, appropriate box that they go in. Whichever box they came out of, just drop them back down in there.